a shake of hands and we're going to get the ball rolling with the 47s final. St. Leonard's Old Boys in the gray, black and red up against the Old Boys from St. George. And things got really going in the 40th minute of play when St. George's Gregory Lalu Goodrich was brought down in the box. And you know what that means? A penalty was awarded. And the former national captain showed that he still got it, easy slotting in to give the St. George Old Boys first dibs. However, the SLB boys will get the chance to level things up as a handball saw them too awarded a penalty. With all the players appealing, the ref's call better be that. And the man to make it count was Marcus Smore into the left pocket. We're locked out one all and it was say that way to the final whistle, so penalties it would be. SLB up first. Ooh, and it's saved by Goodrich who stepped in as custodian at this crucial stage. A man wearing many hats, Goodrich stepped in to take first strike and he put his St. George side in command. Kelvin Scott was up next for SLB. Easy does it. They are now on the cards. St. George still with the edge made the second penalty count. An easy one too. SLB responded with the very next attempt. It was goal for goal. St. George again. But this is where it was won for the boys in green, winning 4-3 on penalties. All the bragging rights in the 47s goes to the Old Scholars team from St. George Secondary. But seeing their 47s team lose the St. Leonard's Old Boys, 35s were not going to let that be their fate as they took on Parkinson. And just six minutes in, Dwayne Mars struck, and so it began. As in the 30th minute, more fireworks for the old boys from Richmond Gap. This time, the defenders were no match for Mark Allen, who made it a 2 0 scoreline, and they stayed that way to the half. And as soon as the second started, Mars was springing to action yet again, gifted a clear path to the bars. He was taking no chances to ensure the ball went right where he intended it to go. And then, Allen said, how about one more for good measure, as he had the right flank all to himself, and watch as he switches to that left foot to curl this one sweetly past the keeper. That's it. Bragging race in the 35s goes to St. Leonard's boys, upper fifth, final scoreline, 4-0 over Parkinson, all scholars. The title is still theirs for keep.